the root of every painting that he makes is a work by another artist. And rather than working from originals, he looks purely at reproductions. So images in books and on the internet and postcards. Okay. Um, but what he's interested in is how kind of disloyal that reproduction is to the original. I think every painter has in mind uh, previous artists' works or renderings of something when they're creating a new image. I was just thinking, you know, trying very hard to find a downside to all this, really. The one I could think of was if you didn't know much about the, is that portrait of Saskia, or it's somewhere between her and, and a self-portrait uh, by Rembrandt, then you wouldn't get the joke. We don't need to know that this no. comes from a Rembrandt. We recognise it as a, yeah. a very traditional type of portraiture. Everyone's seen an image like this somewhere. Yeah. It doesn't matter who painted it. It's a, a modification of something that you do kind of recognise. And that instant recognition draws you in, and again you form a reading of that, and then all the other wacky stuff takes over. Have you noticed what he does with the eyes yes. on one of the portraits that he paints? There's a pretty severe case of cataract. Yes. In many ways, it's to bring you back to the fact that you're, you're looking at a painting. If you see the eyes, it's the first thing you go to, and you make a connection with the person rather than the surface of, of the paint. So it kind of blocks out that, that potential. I'd love to meet him. I really would. 